Alright, what's up YouTube? This your boy Sinister Man in the repair shop. Had to get it uh the pin in my valve stem replaced. I actually gonna show y'all I have I have it. It's a small little piece that when you check it with the tire pressure gauge, uh, sometimes these things get messed up, so the mechanic is letting me know what you do is you gotta keep caps on your valve stems because dirt get up in there and this is how small that little piece is see how small that is this is the this is the joint that's inside your valve stem so when you put your tire pressure inflating uh, tube on it it uh, inflates the tire so these things can go bad if you don't keep caps on your valve stems and are you gonna fix that more flat? Absolutely. Okay. Tack it on. And here's another another tip and a DOT violation right here. Check this out. That mud flat. You see how that look? Yeah, y your legal limit's supposed to be two inches away from the tires. There you go. Let me get let me give my boy a shout out. <laughs> Big shout out, big shout out. Hell What's your yeah. name? Austin. Austin. Brazil Petro. There you go. Yeah. They taking care of me. Oh yeah, because it's rubbing on the inside tire mm -hmm. over here. Oh yeah, definitely. This is why it's important for y'all to do y'all inspection in the morning because these are the things that happen out here. You know what I mean? So you can you can see it. My bar is bent down. So these are the things that's important that y'all got to do. Check your tires. Always gotta check them, child. Check them. So, don't get skimpy with your your pre trip, guys. I'm telling y'all, y'all get skimpy, y'all gonna ask, y'all gonna get problems later. I'd rather spend an hour doing the pre-trip instead of spending five hours on the side of the road waiting for somebody to come get me <laughs> because of a uh, tire going out, something on the trailer not working, something on your tractor not working, and that's what it is, man. Y'all can't, you know, guys walk around, they do the kick in the tire thing. I don't do the kick the tire thing. Um, so, now I know about the mud flat being two inches off your tire. And my inner tire, it's sitting on my tire. If you can see that, right here, it's rubbing against my tire. So, learning, learning every day, learning every day. And that's the thing about being out here on the road, you learn every day every day so he spotted that he said oh gotta fix that so. <laughs> you could you can tell that mud flap is old as hell. Look how stiff it is. <laughs> That's an old mud flap, boy. Boy, that mud flap need to be taken out back and put out his misery. <laughs> stiff, boy. Behind the scenes.
early morning truckish. That's what it is. You get up early, you're like, yeah, you ready to roll until you stumble across that problem. And that's it. That's what it is. That's what happens out here. That's what happens out here. Okay. I gotta go back inside, see her? Yeah. All right. I can leave this right here? Turn it? Yeah. 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 Okay. Thanks. Yeah, man. So, uh, that's what it is. You know, you wake up and you be ready to go. And you, you end up having these trailer problems or tractor problems, tire problems. It could be numerous things. So, I just wanted to bring y'all that. This your boy, Sinister Man. And I definitely uh, holla at y'all in a little bit, all right? Peace out, man. Do your inspections.